When a man is walking in the darkness and death of unregeneracy, he has no true light, he may indeed have a false light, as the light of presumption, delusion, or vain confidence, but all such borrowed light is worse than darkness. As the Lord says, if the light that is in you be darkness, how great is that darkness? The only saving light is the light of God shining into the soul, giving us to see and know the only true God, and Jesus Christ whom he has sent. A man may have the clearest light in his judgment, and yet never have the penetrating light of the Spirit producing conviction in his soul. He may have the soundest knowledge of the doctrines of grace, and see the harmonious scheme of salvation. And yet never have seen a holy God by divine teaching, nor have ever felt the spirituality of God's righteous law condemning him as a transgressor. But the light of life, as the Lord calls it, is sure to guide its possessor aright. If we have it not, we shall be sure to go astray. We shall be entangled in some error, plunge into some heresy, imbibe some doctrine of devils, drink into some dreadful delusion, or fall into some dreadful sin.